Hey, what's happening, guys? Welcome to the Darken Lab. Why are we in the dark? Well, because we're talking about a circuit that activates in the dark. This is what is known as a dark detector, or simply an LDR activated switch. As you can see here, we have a bright light. It's a uh, bright LED. And it's dark, but what happens if I turn on the light? The LED goes out. Why does the LED go out? Well, because the current going to the LED has been changed by that guy right there, a light dependent resistor. And if I cover it, you can see it turns back on. This is a super simple circuit. And it's one that you should know. Let's talk about that. An LDR, or a light dependent resistor, here is its uh, schematic symbol. Want that in LDR? Is nothing but a resistor that changes its resistance based on the amount of light that is affecting it. So our circuit here, which is really simple, let's start off with the transistor. In this case I'm using an NPN transistor, my favorite NPN transistor, the 2N2222A. The 2222A resistor. Now, on the collector of that resistor, I mean of that transistor, we've got a 22K resistor to limit the current. And on the emitter, which in this case is going to be our output, I have a white LED. And that basically goes to ground. This up here goes to our VCC, which in this case is 12 volts. So there's the heart of our circuit. The current comes through this resistor, through the transistor, out through the diode, and to ground. You would classify this as a common collector transistor circuit. But we have nothing on the base controlling the amount of current that goes into there. So what we've done is we've created a voltage divider here, like this. There's our LDR, and that is a 10K resistor. That's going directly into the base. You could put a resistor there if you wanted to, but I have quite simply carefully selected those two resistors to give me what I want. So there is our entire circuit. So here is what is happening. When there is light striking this, well, let me show you. Bring in the super cheapo <clears throat> peak meter. And just hook it up here like so. There we go, pull that out of there. And if I cover it up, you can see there we have 5k of resistance. There we have 0.8k of resistance. So the darker it gets, the more resistance we get. How does that make the circuit work, you say? Well, when there's a lot of resistance here, the current is able to flow through the first resistor. Can't quite push through here 
goes over to the base of the transistor and allows it to flow. Now, when the, when the resistance is low here, when there's a lot of light, the current is able to more easily flow straight through here and to ground. That's why I say it's a super, super simple circuit. Definitely one you should know, be able to use whenever you need to throw something like this into a, a, a larger circuit that you're building. So, here's your quiz of the day. This circuit turns on when it gets dark. If I can make it, there we go. How do you make this circuit using the same components turn on when it gets light? Put your answer in the comment down below. It's pretty simple. I think you guys will get it. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, give me a thumbs up. Feel free to comment, share, and don't forget to subscribe. Big thanks to all the patrons. That's it. I'm out. Peace.